Hello everyone, this is Just a Dad. Today I'm going to show you how to clean this coffee maker, this Black & Decker 12 cup model number DCM3100B with white vinegar. So this coffee maker kind of has a hidden clean option that's not readily displayed on the display or the buttons. So the manual says after 60 cycles, the clean symbol is going to be displayed, letting you know that it's time to clean your coffee maker. Now there's two ways of getting that clean light to go out. You can just unplug it and plug it back in, it'll reset it. Or we're gonna do this clean process and that'll reset the light. We're gonna press and hold down the program button for approximately two seconds. See if we press and hold this, okay? Both these lights come on and it's saying clean. So I'm gonna stop it. But that's what we're gonna be doing. So one of the first things you wanna do is make sure you remove your carbon filter. You could have a carbon filter down there in your water reservoir. The second thing, I just want to talk about this Clearly Coffee. This is a blue solution. You don't run this through the coffee maker, but it's used for cleaning coffee stains. So I've got another video where I've got a coffee maker that's got coffee stains everywhere. This is a concentrated solution. You get it off Amazon for five bucks. You just put a little bit on the plastic wherever the stain is or on the, the glass. Let it soak and just rub it off with a brush and then clean it with soap and water. This stuff works really well, but it is a pretty harsh chemical, so use gloves and wash everything with soap and water wherever it has been. So let's get on to the vinegar. I buy the 64 fluid ounces from Walmart. This is about a buck 50. So the first thing we're gonna do is make sure we have no, you wanna take your filter out. If you've used paper filters or this reusable, reusable one, Remove it, just leave the filter basket empty. We're gonna close it. Then back here, we're gonna put, we're gonna fill this up to the 12 cup mark with this vinegar. And we're gonna put it right where the water goes. Now this vinegar, when it's brewing, it does kind of smell, so make sure you've got some ventilation. We're just, so this 64 fluid ounces fills it right up to the 12 cup mark. So we're gonna close this. So we're gonna come down here. We've got our coffee pots empty. Like I said, this is where we're gonna do that clean process. So we're gonna come down and hold this button. Okay, so it says clean. The bulb light came on and these two lights came on. Now this is a timing. So it's gonna brew a little bit and stop. Brew a little bit and stop. So don't think your coffee maker's broke. So right now it started, it's brewing that white vinegar. And the reason behind this is it wants to let that heating element inside the coffee maker soak. And that helps remove the deposits on that heating element. So this, by doing this clean process with the machine, takes about, takes about 30 minutes. After we're said and done, we got it, then we'll have a pot full of vinegar. We're gonna throw that vinegar out and we're gonna wash this out, and then we're gonna run two pots of just clean water through on a normal brew. So I'm gonna pause it, and I'll time how long this clean process takes. Okay, so that took about 30 minutes. It beeps at you when it's done, so that's nice to let you know that, hey, the cleaning cycle is done. It turns everything off. Now we've got a pot full of vinegar. We're gonna throw this vinegar out, and then we're going, to, you might see some white deposits in there from the heating element, and that's okay. Then we're gonna clean this out and fill this up with fresh water. Okay, so I cleaned this out. We're gonna leave, we're gonna leave um, that empty, no coffee, no filter, nothing. Got this cleaned out. We're gonna put it back. I filled my water reservoir up with just fresh water now. Now we're just gonna do a normal brew. Just do a normal brew. This is gonna brew just straight water through the coffee maker to rinse out that white vinegar. I'm gonna do two to three pots, depending on if you, how bad your coffee maker was. Um, so normally two pots of just fresh water does just fine. So once this runs through, this takes about 15 minutes, and then I'm gonna throw it out, fill the water reservoir back up with water, and do another brew. So start to finish, you gotta give yourself about an hour, hour and 15 minutes to do this. But you need to do this at least every you know six months. I try to do mine at least every year. So if you got any questions on how I cleaned it or what products I used, um, please leave your comments down below. I check my comments on a daily basis. I hope this video helps. My videos are just to kind of help people 
uh, with coffee makers in general. And thanks everybody for watching. If you could, please like and subscribe.